It is time now for the Peter Channel Morning News on this Tuesday morning, February 9th, 2016. Go! Go! Oh, good morning to you all on this lovely Tuesday morning here, February 9th, 2016. Here, here are your news and eyes here, and on top story here at... 8 a.m. here on this Tuesday morning. There is Donald Trump on Monday night repeated defense term as woman attended his rally, shot in reference to Texas Senator Ted Cruz. If you are reading this, the voting has already begun in New Hampshire in the first of the nation barbarians. Standing tasks like Tixville Notch and Arts Location gas are at midnight. German Transport Minister Alexander Dumit says that the two passenger trains that crashed in the bad river were uncovered appears at the end, as drivers likely didn't see the error before the crash. As eight highest commuter trains crash head on in Germany. Tan and Tyron, the police have arrested a builder at a 17 story apartment complex that collapsed in the pre dawn earthquake on Saturday here in southwestern Taiwan. The city government announced Tuesday afternoon in Beirut, the United States just says hundreds of thousands of people in Syria's largest city could be soon cut off. New Delhi, scientists are analyzing a small blue object that plummeted from the sky and killed a man in southern India after 40 days said it was a meteorite. Hong Kong, Hong Kong, Red Police fired water shots on Tuesday during clashes that erupted in the Chinese World City when a 40 days tried to remove illegal street stalls set up for Lunar New Year, a celebration of the worst violence since for democracy. Stringer, India, a Indian soldier buried by an avalanche for six days in the Himalayan region of Kashmir has been found alive and pulled from the store along with the bodies that died of her soldiers, officials said on Tuesday. 409 migrants died in March 2016. Byron, a car bomb driven by a suicide attacker, exploded Tuesday near a police officer's club in the Syrian capital of Damascus, killed at least 10 people, causing wide material damage, state media said. Washington, the widow of Islamic State senior leader, was charged with conspiracy in the killing of in the 2004. 14 killed an American aid worker, Carrie Miller, official said. Washington, Attorney General Lauren Atlantic has been confirmed that the FBI has formed the Hillary Clinton's use of the private email server while the Secretary of State is free outside of political influence. This photo provided by Eric Johnson shows a 4 inch lock hand that was clicked by a German entrance who trimmed John Lennon's air before he started shooting. Harry won the war as lock up. Let us say respect to fetch ten thousand dollars in adoption. Blacksburg, Virginia. A Robert United held of Virgil and Blacksburg, Virginia, remember, thirteen years ago it was fatally stabbed last month. Washington, President Obama on Tuesday will send his fourth trillion dollar final annual budget to the Republican Land Congress, which guaranteed many of his proposals would be rejected. Japanese stocks plunged 5.4 percent. Treasury set for the best start of the year since 1980. The gold price for the day. Tokyo, given Japan's outsized public debt and holding the IOU from its government, might seem like a risky proposition that would occur. The promise of a substantial war. IEA predicts that supply exceeded uh, by 2 MBD by quarter one in 2016, by 1.5 MBD in quarter two to 2016, with global economy slowed down, down more pressure on oil looks in a miniature. With Sacco Bernard, CVS Health Corporation on Tuesday reported four quarter earnings of one and a half billion dollars. With Sacco Bernard, base company said it had a profit of one dollar thirty four cents a share. All right, look at stocks here today. Sixty nine twenty seven point oh five. That was thirty two points down. SP five eighteen fifty three point forty four. And that's a quarter thousand two eighty three point seventy five. In Canberra. Australia, Division of the World Meteorological Organization criticized that Australia would have cut staff from a compensation division as worse. Calgary, Alberta, Canada, Nini Noah Sands, and that's it. Entire board of directors is compromised by former leaders of a rival subcourt as a household takeover hook takes hold. Oklahoma City, shares of the U.S. oil and gas company Chesapeake Energy Corporation received a recovery loss grant after the was seeking financial guidance but not filed for bankruptcy. Midland, Texas, and Texas Energy Regulators took a note symbol of the struggle industry said the dual state oil sector is positioned for a rebound once markets improve. Australia's National Science Agency has announced last week plans to cut hundreds of climate research positions to move hours. Men met with criticism from leaner organizations. 
Scientists have lately discovered two clusters of bunch of red cockroach species, each with their own name to sell. The nav brings a genus or a total of three distant species from the three separate regions of the world. This large group of common sites has made an embracing statement in a general nature climate change algorithm that we have mistaken we think the global warming is only a matter of the next hundred years or so. In fact, President Obama is asking Congress for what would billion dollars in emergency funding that would be part funded expedited efforts to develop a sick vaccine, but even with a presidential power, the funded vaccines could still be a while. Ordinary people will suffer even a mild congestion experience of threefold increase in the likelihood of suicide according to a new study conducted by researchers in Canada. Renata Christina de Costa, left spread, propelled on the daughter of Tim Mr. Costa, who was four months pregnant at home noon. Real estate journey in Brazil has Zika virus raised for more questions than the answers for pregnant women. The mayor of Hawaii has begun to close state emergency with blood data deal with a corona outbreak and dengue fever spread by infected mosquitoes with 250 cases of confirmed over the past four months. Peter Chell do sub 806 Tada for Sport to Port here tonight. The Boston Bruins will be at the Garden Night taking on the Los Angeles Kings game time 7 o'clock while the Boston Celtics will be at the Milwaukee taking on the Milwaukee Bucks game time 8 o'clock which is 7 o'clock their time here. Now that Derek Fitch has been intruded to at Madison Square Garden, it's time for speculation on who will take over the always hot seat at the end of the Knicks but just because as could it be Tom Thibodeau, Luke Walton, or Patrick Ewing. Peyton Manning and Denver to take the streets in Denver Tuesday for the Super Bowl parade. The Sacramento Kings lost to the Cleveland Cowboys on Monday to Blood Fashion 121, but that was least an organization's worries. As Rich on Rundle reveals, Kings players skipped shoot around before game versus the Cavaliers. NBA Commissioner Adam Silver has come around with the so called hacker shack strategy and potentially found four, four, three shooters of three fours are ready for the ball. Plans to make a real change to eliminate this as strategy tactics once in the current season is over. Peter Chalodusab is now 807 here. Start off at Trevor Port on this. To the morning here. Maybe. Let's start off out in Renown here. We're 95 in the south bad side of the sofa. Protecting all against the downtown Providence here. 95 in the north bad side of the sofa. Three airport connected more cars to downtown Providence here. 95 in the north bad side of the sofa. Route 4, the north Kingstown route. 17, 117 in work here. Route 4 to the north bad side of the sofa. The north Kingstown stretch. Route 6 in the east, Bassett, so for Justin and Providence, 6 10 connectors, so for Justin and Providence, Providence here. 146 in the south, Bassett, so for Lake and Providence, downtown Providence here. 295 in the north, Bassett, so for the Crest Street Switch. 295 in the north, Bassett, so for Route 1 in Adler, North Adler, Orient, Route 95 here. 146 in the south, Bassett, so for North Smith to Lincoln Stretch. 99 in the north, Bassett, so for 295 in Lincoln, all the way at the Route 122 to Woodsocket here. 95 in the north, Bassett, is slow from 295 in Adler, all the way out to Route 1 in Walpole, doing in the next day on 95 in the north side around Route Exit 8 and Sharon, so expect some delays here. And then Hitbrick came the, from north all the way to Route 120 to Catanier. 24 to the north side, so from Avon all the way out to Route 120 to Catanier. Route 3 to the north side, so from 228 in Rackland all the way to the Bray Tree Split here. 140 to the south side, so from Route 195 to Route 6 to Dartmouth here. South East Expressway to South Bantai, so for the Dutch Chester Church, South East Express to the North Bantai, so the Braintree Split, all the way up to the Mass Park here. Mass Park in the East Bantai, so for Route 9, the Frame Ave, all the way up to the South East Express, Mass Park in the West Bantai side, it is so from Logan Airport, all the way up to the Pruitt Tunnel, doing the next of the year on Cobworth Avenue in Boston here. 93 in the South Bantai, it is so from <clears throat> Stone all the way up to the Zaken Bridge, Route 1 in the South Bantai, it's so from Route 6 in the river, all the way out to Route 1 in 93 in Boston here. 128 in the North Bantai, so for Route 1 in. <coughs> now we're all the way out to Route 20 in Waltham. I'm doing it at Axe Data Yard. Route 1 at 20 in the North Bantai, before exit 19 in Dallas Street in Needham, so expect the delays there. 128 in the South Bantai, so for 128 out of Red, all the way out to Route 2 in the Lexington, doing it at Axe Data Yard. 128 in the South Bantai, around Route 2 in the Lexington there. Route 2 in the west bad side, so from 4 to 25 to Route 1 to Lexington. Route 2 in the east bad side is so from Route 6 in Melbourne, all the way up to Cambridge here. 495 in the north bad side, so from A5 in Wilford, all the way up to Route 9 in Westbury here. Route 3 in the south bad side, and it's so from 4 to 1 to 8 in Wilson, and also it breaks in from 485 in all the way to Bill Ricca here. 
93 is up by Zaya is slow for the Lord, stretch around. Route 93 in the Moose Dune launch, stretch at 93 is also up by Zaya. So all we have to say on New Hampshire here. Out in Worcester here, 290 in the eastbound side it is. So from Mass Pike and Auburn all the way up to Route 9 in Worcester, 146 in the southbound side. A little around the Mass Pike in Auburn, 146 in the northbound side. So before Route 2 in Worcester, Route 190 in the southbound side. So before 2 in Worcester and 2 in the southbound side. It's all around Route 190 in Worcester here. Out in Springfield here. 291 in the stop on side is slow after Route 90 mass back in Springfield and 291 hit breaks again before Route 91 here. 57 on the eastbound side slow before Route 91 in Springfield. 91 is not bound side so from 57 in Angmom all the way after mass back in Chicken Bay here. 91 in the stop on side a little slow from the north and the Deerfield stretches here. And in Connecticut here, 91 on both ends, it is slow from Winslow all the way to Hartford down, IA4, 91 on the side, so from Middletown out to IA4 in Hartford here, IA4 in the eastbound side, so from Farmington all the way to Hartford here, and IA4 in the westbound side, it is slow before Route 91 in Hartford here, 291 on the westbound side, so from IA4 in Manchester all the way to Route 91 in Winslow, and we get a next to the 99 one step on, I mean, in Winslow Airport Roadway in Winslow, so expect some delays here. I-84 in the eastbound side, so from Route 8 in Toronto, we have Route 691 here. 95 on the southbound side is slow from Bridgeport, all the way up to Stamford and Greenwich. Route 8, 15 on the southbound side, so from Bridgeport, all the way up to Norwalk. Route 8 on the northbound side is slow around the Bridgeport stretch. I-95 on the northbound side is slow from the New Haven stretch. I-91 on the southbound side is slow from the New Haven stretch. Route 2 in the eastbound side is slow from Fitchburg to Lemon Street here. Up in Vermont, it is looking good except I-91 in the northbound side, a little support for I-89 in Woodstock, Vermont here. Out in New Hampshire, 101 in the eastbound side, it is slow before Route 95 in Hampton, New Hampshire, 93 in the southbound side, a little slow dirty stretch, 93 in the northbound side, so before 293 in Manchester, and after every trip I got to the northbound side, so before the 293 in Manchester, and every trip I go a little slow around the New Hampshire stretch. I-89 on the southbound side, it is so from Pillsbury all the way up to Concord, Hampshire. I-89 on the northbound side, it is so around the Warner Stretch here. 393 on the westbound side, a little so on the Concord Stretch up in Maine near 295 on the southbound side, it is so from Falmouth all the way up to Portland, and we get an exit on 295 on the southbound side around the Portland Stretch around Route 1, so expect some delays in South Portland. Falmouth Spurs looking a little slow, looking good for 95 to 95. 95 looking good good in the main trip out of York and Augusta, except 95 is stopped inside a little slow after. 295 in Augusta here, but 95 on the both ends of the slow from Bangor all the way at the Waterville, and 95 is stopped inside all the way down in Augusta here. And 95 is stopped inside a little slow in Orno here. Alright, look at that MBTA alerts here. Civil Hot Nelson 5 Experience and Minor Delays in the Sable Bus, SL4 Experience and Minor Delays here. Computer Rail, Worcester Line, Train 5.7 a.m. From Worcester, it's operating 5 to 10 minutes behind to go between West State Station and South Station here. Low Line, Train 307, 7.25 a.m. From North Station, departing North Station, it is operating 10 to 15 minutes late through the late arrival equipment here. New Bayport. Rockford Train 101, 7.4 a.m. Operating 5 to 10 minutes beyond schedule between Chelsea and Rockford Train 808, 637 a.m. Operating 5 to 15 minutes beyond schedule between Medical Station and the South Station due to the train traffic here. Part of Train 8.2736 a.m. Medical to operate 10 to 15 minutes beyond schedule between Medical Station and the South Station and the Ferries there. Look good here. Peter Chalder, Sabs out. 814 here. Set off a weather report here on this. To the body there. Okay, take a look at the weather here and looking at the radar, and it shows some ocean effect snow showers from Yarmouth stretching up south shore, and some snow showers off Crescent situated here and stretching up down south of Gloucester here. 
and also seeing some snow shots east of Stafford and west of Putman, Connecticut, and stretching it down east of Springfield, and a lot of snow shots for Menfield, Connecticut, stretching it down for Winston, towards it down for Waterbury, down for Brookfield, Connecticut, and seeing some snow shots by Huntington, Long Island, and snow shots north of Riverhead, Long Island, there. And seeing some funny snow shots in the north side of New Hampshire, and seeing some snow shots north of Augusta, and stretching up the Caribou, Maine, stretching it down through the Canadian Maritimes from New Brunswick, and east to Nova Scotia, and such an at the sea. Here. Okay, Kevin. First, we're going to take a look at a special weather statement here because scattered light snow showers and flurries are gradually coming to an end by mid morning, but some locations may receive a fresh coat of one and a half inch of ours. The main concern is that temperatures will below freeze and untreated roads remain snow. It's coming and slipping for the morning rush hour. More to throw urge to drive an extra caution here. Okay, as a weather outlook, day one to eight tonight, as the weather is not expected at the time here. And day two for seven is Wednesday for Monday, a scattered every snow shots are possible. Wednesday is most likely a connected and the south coast at a quick inch so of cumulative possible, which may impact the morning commute here. Okay, seven day forecast goes like this. For today, I say snow shots. Most cost guys have about 20 degrees, drop about three to six miles. That just is 20%. Then, as the snow shots may up to 3 a.m., class guys low about 21 degrees. Come with chest patients, four percent new snow accumulation less than an average possible here. Wednesday, snow shots are made between 7 a.m. and 11 a.m. Class guys are about 36 degrees and 9 a.m. Wind chest patients is 6 percent new snow accumulation less than one inch possible. Wednesday, the slight chest of snow shots, most class guys low about 19 degrees and west about 3 to 5 miles an hour. Chest patients 20 percent. Thursday, a chest of snow shots are made between 11 a.m. and 3 p.m. Most class guys are about 30 degrees and west about 5 to 8 miles an hour. Chest shots are 30 percent. Third that, park has got about 6 degrees. Friday, most guys got about 24 degrees. Friday that, a chance to saw after 2 a.m. Most guys got about 30 degrees. A chance to saw after 30%. Saturday, chance to saw before 10 a.m. Punch center park has got about 22 below, 3 below. Chance to saw 30%. And from Sunday, most center park has got about 40 below, 1 above. And Foster's birthday on Monday, a chance to saw shot. Most guys got about 29 degrees. And chance to saw 30%. Currently in Norton, it's 23 and overcast. Now, 24 to overcast to the humidity of 78%. And that is going to be it for the Peter Chell. Bottom news on this. To the bottom, February 9th, 2016. I'm Peter Chell. Good morning, dear. Have a good day.